Hello and welcome to this um, quick uh, video tutorial. Um, in this one basically I'm just going to show you um, how to download the jQuery library and a quick explanation about what jQuery is. So um, to start off with let's just go to our favourite um, web browser and just type in jQuery.com. Okay, jQuery is a framework for JavaScript Okay, that basically um, negates any browser compatibility well nearly all of it so any any times where you've had problems with JavaScript and you're like oh it doesn't work in Internet Explorer but it works in Chrome and it doesn't work in this uh, jQuery is something that's just bundled very very tightly and it just shortens everything up for you and it worries about all of the um, the compatibility issues for you so you know you can be quite happy that it works it's a really really good framework to do to use and to uh, to, to have there's tons of documentation about it. You can buy books about it and so on. I mean, it's really, really quick and easy to download. Okay, so you go to jQuery.com and you see this big button saying download jQuery. Click on that. Now, there's two ways of downloading. You can either download the compressed version, which you want for production websites, okay, because it lo loads faster, there's less text in it, all of the variables are just like A and B and C and so on, so you can't read it for anything, um, but it works. Now, or you can download the uncompressed version where they've all got nice names and you can read it properly and it's nicely structured. So really for production purposes, just click on the download the compressed production version. Now all of this text what you want to do is just want to highlight it all and copy it and save it to then um, a, a JavaScript file on your web server and then just include that one um, file it's nothing more than that alright so that's basically the jQuery library now I've got other tutorials about how to use the jQuery library so I don't particularly want to get hugely involved um, in showing it right now that's how you find it that's how you can download it all right now if you do do the um, uncompressed version you see here that it's this nice I don't know 15,000 line um, file with all of the jQuery in there which you can then study which you can learn to see how it is but potentially you don't want this one version because you want it to be quicker loading Right. If you need to study it, then you download this one. If you want it to be practical and to load fast, then you download um, the compressed version. Now, Google does also have a, a version of it, but I mean, I particularly like to use the jQuery library just itself from the jQuery uh, website. Okay, it's an excellent framework to use. Okay, it can do animation, drag and drop, changing styling, and so on, um, manipulating a web page it can do everything okay and there's um, there's APIs galore with it there's date pickers there's all sorts of stuff with the jQuery library I really really advise you and recommend to look into using the jQuery library if you bang your head against the wall all the time because of JavaScript and I don't know how to do this this isn't working wait a minute Internet Explorer doesn't do this Chrome does that Safari does this jQuery library okay it resolves nearly every single issue I pretty much never, I, I write lots of JavaScript code, but I pretty much use jQuery every single time um, to try and resolve any of these problems. Okay, And potentially with jQuery you don't have problems anymore, you just have solutions. It's a bit of a cliche there, but um, it's very, very good. Alright, that's all I've got to say. Right, um, that's it. Quick, short, sharp tutorial. Um, that's the jQuery library. Go over to the API documentation have a read about it um, research it has a nice Ajax library I mean it's just got a huge long list of things that it does for you okay um, that's it have a good look yourself and uh, welcome to the world of jQuery